at the rate we are going, by the year 2073, the average American should be making a million dollars per year. And at the same point, the average Major League Baseball player should be making around $7.8 billion at that time. Hello, my name is Derek. Hope everyone is doing magnificent. And I did some number crunching uh, based on uh, performances over the last four decades and where we should be going if we are moving at the same rate. So in 2073, it's set up that the average baseball player should be making about almost $8 billion per year. What I have done, I have taken data from the uh, 1969. That's when the average baseball player made almost 25 k in 79, a little over 120,000, almost a half a million in 89, 1.7 million in 99, and this year, $3.2 million. So the average uh, annual increase for a Major League Baseball player over the last 40 years has been 12.94%. If that continues on going, we should be seeing some pretty big numbers for these baseball players as the year 2113, it should be $1 trillion a year for the average baseball player and by 2170, a quadrillion dollars. So if you want to be a baseball player, the money is there. Now, as far as the per capita income, as I was saying, by that point, you would make a million dollars in 2173. Back in 1969, the average income was 3,007, 79, it was 7,168, 89, a little over 14,000, over 21,000 in 1999, and last year in 2008, it was almost 27,000 for an increase of 5.64% a year. Not the same increase that baseball players get, but nonetheless, by the year 2,126, the average American should be making $20 million per year. And by the year 2,277, $100 billion per year. And this is going to get exciting, guys. Year 2,500 AD, $280 quadrillion per year. Wow. As far as minimum wage is concerned, in 1969 it was a buck thirty, then it was two ninety, three thirty-five, five fifteen, and today it is seven twenty-five, which is an increase of around four point four percent per year, which means that by the year twenty fifty-four, it should be about fifty bucks an hour. The year twenty two thirty-one, about a hundred thousand dollars an hour, and twenty for 46, you will be making a billion dollars an hour at this rate. The national debt in 1969, it was 0.35 trillion. It's so big, we'll put these numbers in trillions. 79.83 trillion, a little over uh, 2 trillion in 1989, over a half, 5 trillion in 99, and today it's over 12 trillion dollars. So based on this, we should be at a hundred trillion dollars by 2033 and a million trillion in the year 2138. The increase has been 9.22% per year since 1969. Oh man, these are some pretty big numbers, but you know I can't continue this way. But if we do continue on the same pace, that's what's going to be going on. And I've seen some great stuff on uh, the uh, debt clock. And what I'm seeing here is that the unemployed people, we are having a new person unemployed every 23 seconds when I was looking at it today. Uh, a new person on food stamps every, uh, what do we got here? Uh, every eight seconds, a new person goes on food stamps. Food stamps. The national debt grows a million dollars higher every 30 seconds. And every 25 seconds, the Federal Reserve creates one million dollars. But hey, you know what? Some good news is that we are seeing the national debt or the uh, private debt, sorry. It's actually going lower. If you, at least it was today. 
I did a three minute, over three minute time frame. I seen the US private debt go down over two and a half million. This is every single one of us who has credit card debt, mortgage debt, any kind of debt with the financial institution, it's going lower. Reason for that, they're simply not lending as much money anymore. At least that's what I would guess to be the reason. Over that same three minute time frame, the national debt and the budget deficit up over $6 million. And uh, the trade deficit with China, it was almost a million dollars in just three minutes. So when I came on here talking about debt, this is what we're getting. You create interest based on nothing. Federal Reserve has a monopoly on the mon monetary system. Ta-da! This is what we get. Thank you all for watching. Peace out, everyone.